asleep from her eyes Finds the note that's lying there Well, we got a call from someone saying that there was a cat on the uh, Eastbound 60 interchange off the 15 South Freeway. And I went up there and I saw that this cat was about 200 feet up on the highest bridge that they had and was up on the barrier hanging off the edge trying to get away from traffic. Myself and CH, or the California Highway Patrol were able to uh, stop traffic and get the cat. The cat was very happy for me to uh, get her and I was very happy to get her off there. It kind of looks like she might be pregnant too. Definitely somebody's cat. Well, there's an approximate four foot barrier, that four foot high barrier that's on the side of the bridge to keep uh, you know cars from going over if they were to lose control. And it was on top of that, but as far over south as possible to get away from the traffic without falling over the side. So it was kind of stuck between traffic and a 200 foot drop. It's highly improbable that the cat walked up there itself. Look at how nice the cat is, it is definitely somebody's cat, and being that it's pregnant, I seriously think somebody threw it out the window. And with the injuries it had on its face and its body, it looked like road rash. So, I think it just got up on top of that barrier to get away from the traffic. Well, my thoughts on that is that it's completely unnecessary. You know, if things are so bad that they can't hang on to the animal, they can always drop it off at the shelter. You know, there's always things that can be worked out. It's not worth taking a life and thrown in a predicament like that. And besides the cat, it could hurt somebody else too. Somebody trying to miss the cat, they could get in an accident and kill themselves or kill somebody else. It's just in the end, just not worth it. Oh, very friendly. She's definitely with somebody's cat before. She's, even when she was up on top of the bridge, she didn't want to hiss or even try to resist me. She just was very welcoming in me picking her up in that predicament.